So in the previous class, we talked about uh, setting up the layout of our application. Now, in this part, we are going to be talking about modal pop-up. The reason is because we want to, when someone clicks on add new country, it's going to display a modal pop-up, allowing the person to actually fill a form and then submit. So this is what we call modal or uh, modal pop-up form. So there are a number of ways to actually do uh, handle this model pop-up. Um, the first thing is that you can actually see in my website, you can add a button uh, that launches the model pop-up form. So to do that, I have a button here. I'm just going to take it across. I'm going to take this button across and use it. Um, so I'm going to go to the country component. First, I'm going to close everything. I'm going to open the country component and we, are, we want to add a button on top of the country component. So I should be adding it somewhere here. I think it should be somewhere here. Let's save it. If it looks good, then fine. If not, we are going to move it to another place. So let's see. Um, so you see it doesn't look good. You can see. Well, if I go back to this place and look for model, but I don't know if I can find model. So if I go to look at the page source, I go to look at the page source. Uh, actually, the, it's better to actually use the documentation on Bootstrap. So I'm going to go to Bootstrap model. So Bootstrap model uh, is easy. It's easier to use than every other thing. So you see one model form here. We can actually just use it. So just copy this and use. That's what we are going to do. Um, but we also need the button as well. So I'm going to copy all of this because this launches the model. So I'm going to copy all of this and simply use it. So this includes the button as well. So I'm copying everything. I'm going to my application. And here I'm going to simply paste. Uh, let's see, I have this D bother here. And I'm going to simply, uh, let's see. Paste this, paste, I pasted it there uh, inside the container. So let's save and see what happens. So hopefully it works. If it works, it makes, it, it makes life uh, very much easier for us. So I'm going to this place and launch model and it works. It works the first time. When something works the first time, I'm really so happy. So the launch model works. So this is how to add model pop-up. In the next class, we now talk about forms. So I'm trying to put UI elements on this form and then be able to submit. I'd like to thank you again for viewing and also I'd like to remind you to subscribe to my channel. I remain thanks on the Tech Pro and we'll see you in the next part.